are now going to take lube oil sample from the stern tube lube oil system that sample will be sent for lube oil analysis so from where we have to take the sample for stern tube lube oil system there will be always a dedicated sampling point for the stern tube blue oil system it is already highlighted you can see that so you have to get down to the tank top where the sampling valve is there this uh, stern tube sampling valve will be always blank so that uh, by mistakenly it won't be opened by anyone so for uh, its uh, propeller shaft and uh, you can see in below the shaft we have the sampling point so this is the valve and uh, our third engineer is opening the valve blank so once the end flange is opened as we follow the regular procedure you have to drain the oil little before taking samples so you can use a bucket or a tray for uh, draining the oil you drain at least 5 5 to 10 liters of lube oil from the stern tube system so that any oil in the line will get completely out and ensure your uh, stern tube pump is in operational it should be working so now what we are doing is uh, we are uh, opening the valve to drain the stern tube lube oil so this stern tube sampling point will be always unique do not take from the stern tube pump as uh, we are going to take this you have to take a bottle sampling bottle and it should be named here we had named that as stern tube now we are going to take the sample so oil had been drained enough now we are going to take the sample see you have to take 80 to 90 percentage of the total capacity of the sampling bottle and uh, once the sample is taken do not close it just keep it open for getting it cool down so once the sampling is taken again we need to blank the flange for the stern tube sampling valve so do not take sample from the stern tube lube oil pump always take from the dedicated sampling point and this sampling point is been dedicated by the uh, shipyard only and this is how you have to keep it keep the sampling bottle open till the time it get completely cool down the oil will get cool down by the meantime you can write the lab analysis checkpoints all those details you can fill and you can send it for analysis